Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and welcome to Steam World Dig, a fistful of dirt. Let's just jump straight in and I'll ramble over the top of it. This game is fantastic. Um, I haven't played that much of it, I've played a fair bit to be, to be honest with you, but I've never played it on the PlayStation 4. I've played it on the PS Vita, so it's quite nice to have it actually on a big screen. Uh, the art style is fantastic. Welcome to Dumbleton! Yeah, population 3. Oh no, we're on the ground. Ah. Splat. And I'm dead already. Well, thanks for joining us. If only that were the case. Whoop. Here we go. <gasps> well, I don't reckon I got... Get out the way I got in. Could be part of my uncle's mind. So yeah, that's the story. You gotta go. You turn up to a town. And um, then you meet this woman. There we go. So, rubble on top of that, basically, you um, have now found your uncle after you've been sent to claim his mine and good old uh, uncle's not doing too well. So, he's not my miner, but he's, he's going to fulfill his, yeah, and fulfill his uncle's legacy and be a, be a, be a miner. Eh, eh, eh. Yeah, so the, ah, that's the basic point. But there's your life in the little circle. The other ones before, to show you if I see one. I think I got one before, to be fair. Our little um, lamp. So it keeps your fuel up, which you can see in the top corner. So we found a pickaxe, and now I have to clear the tunnel. And find the lever, which points its way on the little map, you see. Um, which, this, this, later you get, like, things. So. Yeah. See, now my circle's like gets bigger. Um, like, to be fair, early game, it, it's, it's not really, really that important. Later on, it does become somewhat of a pain in the ass. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, I always forget. <laughs> this game has, um, has, has, has gravity. So, like, if I dig straight down from there, it gets rid of that. So I'll just drop there. Come on. Lever. Ding. Now back up again. So yeah, it's it's basically you just dig and find minerals and ores and treasure and all sorts of lovely, lovely loveliness. Which you then like sell and then you can upgrade yourself to dig further and dig more and it's 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 that kind of kind of Minecrafty vibe to be fair. Here we are, here we are on the surface in Tumbleton, a little town. A nice, the nice, lovely little town it is. So we've got to go follow Dorothy, speak to Dorothy. And have like a report. Seeing as you're your owner and all, maybe you should keep it open. Bring any ore you find back up to me, and I'll give you a fair rate for it. This town sure can use it. I'm Dorothy, by the way. Now why don't you try mining some precious stones? Okay. Here we go. See, there's already one there already. I see it, I see it. I'm gonna... <laughs> see that thing there in the bottom? It looks like a weird kind of furry worm. They're bad things and they explode and like, send out the whole thing. Since they're still alive, but... We've got some trash in here. Yeah. Ooh! There's something. Hip, hip. To be fair, there is a very like, kind of clever-ish way to do this. And that's not the way I'm doing it. At all. One of the cleverest ways to do it is obviously dig a big like shaft, a lovely, lovely mine shaft, all the way down, and then you can kind of dig. Like because of how you can how you can jump, you can basically just hollow out an entire area and just go along and completely strip everything, which um, I started to do on my PS Vita save. But for now, see what I mean? There we go. He's exploded, and now he walks around, and now he will eat your face. So I'm slowly, slowly picking things up. Um, we'll drop down this way. I'll probably eventually wait for this thing to get you this way. Yeah. <laughs> but you kill them and you get stuff for killing them, so it's always grinded to kill them. Some more trashium. I'll tell you what, we're not full, but we'll go down the other side in a second. We'll head up to the top and see what she'll give us. Yeah. Oh, not even level one yet. Damn it! But yeah, you get money for it, and then with the monies, you can upgrade stuff, which is obviously 
always very, very fun. We'll go down this way. Oh, we can't go through there yet. Damn it. Yeah, so as you go on, you get better picks and stuff. The art style on this game, though, man. Man, this art style. This is one of probably the first thing that attracted me to it when I saw it. Just proper around on the PlayStation Network store. Was um, how absolutely brilliant the art style of the game is. There we go. It does look really good, I must admit. It does look really, really good. We'll go up and trade this thing because we needed eight for level to get the next level, so we'll do that. It's like, as you can see, it's like all games that are kind of miney and crafty. Mm -hmm. um, but it, it just, it, it takes it takes a while to get going, but then when you get going, you end up going pretty far, and there's caves to find, and you can do like teleports to get back up to the surface quicker. It's really good. It's really good. I highly recommend that people people get it and play with it and have some fun with it. What's this? Yeah, dig some hard soil. See, you can see there. There's like a he lost a leg to the mine. He's cranky. We're a mining town with no mine. See, you can get. I can get a copper pickaxe, which is obviously the next one up. <coughs> Sorry about that. And then a ladder, which the ladders are quite useful. I try to avoid them because. It comes very, very expensive. See, there we go, Seals Muck Cave. So now we have a nice little thing. So anything in this space, so anything lower than that line is gonna take is four times as much to mine, you see. So it's quite handy to have like see now I'm just one hitting it. See basically as long as you do like what I haven't done there is a perfect example. If you kind of play it smartly, you will should be able to get back up. The ladders do come in handy because it lets you reach like places some ore and AC, which I'll probably forget about and never end up collecting. Because I'm, 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 I'm stupid. Uh, also, it does mean you can get all that you would otherwise completely and utterly miss. does mean you can go get all that you would otherwise miss with the ladders. The ladders are handy, but I, I try to avoid using them. I try to be more careful with how I mine in this game. But yeah, just, just little wall jumps in the fun. Like, I don't know. I don't think you can. But I don't know. It would be pretty cool if I can upgrade them. Um, my little robot dude but I don't think I can upgrade him as I said I haven't played very much of this game I've just played a little bit oh these blocks are very interesting and um, they will fall so which is why I'm going this way so if I go underneath it and mine that one they have gravity and they will fall right so I leave that thing ow as you can see, I can only take two hits at the moment, so it's quite important I don't get hit that often. Okay. Mind this. And we'll mind this. And now we'll go up. And we'll get ourselves a brand new pick. Because we can get the copper pick, actually. Do. Ah, damn it. It's been far, far too long a day for me to sit down and play games right now. <laughs> I just want to sleep. It's a very hard day of work. Right, trade. Yes, Dorothy. Take it. Take my ore. There it is. Yeah. Yeah. See, that's you level up and you get more upgrades. Which, all of which are very, very handy. Um, so we've got a medium pouch now we can have. And we've got a lamp, which you can put down and obviously give you permanent light, which is nice. Because um, light does become an issue later on, which you'll see. You will see how light becomes an issue. Two plus ground damage. Sturdier than what you've got, at least. Yeah, I'll take it. Next one's 50. Oh, I've only got four. I'm going to buy some more health. Well, never mind. Well, I'll tell you what. Seems I've just got a brand new pickaxe, guys. And I don't want this video to last too long and be boring. I will leave it there today. So, if you've enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a like. And maybe even if you're up to it, subscribe to the channel. And you can check out what else I've got. Other than that, 
hopefully a new episode of this soon. I'll see what I feel like. So, thank you very much for watching, and I will just have to see you all a lot later. Bye-bye.